I'm so proud to be a Carol Dragon. And I feel like you deserve some of the facts from what happened yesterday. For nine minutes on Facebook Live Thursday. We did receive three complaints. Carol ISD Superintendent Dr. Lane Ledbetter talked about the student situations that are now under investigation by the Department of Education's Office for Civil Rights, or OCR. So at this point, they received a complaint. It met the guidelines. It falls under their jurisdiction. So they're notifying us that they need additional information. On Wednesday, the Department of Education confirmed three investigations were opened at Carroll ISD into allegations related to discrimination based on race, color, national origin, or sex. I want to be very clear that no determination has been made by the Office of Civil Rights with respect to the validity of these complaints at this time. The superintendent said Thursday that the district has not received a copy of the complaints that were filed in April. If OCR determines that there are steps that we can take beyond what we have implemented, then we will absolutely comply. Legal experts say it's unknown how long the OCR's investigation will take. Now, if there's a finding of, of some wrongdoing and the school district is unwilling to um, rectify that, um, there is a chance that federal funding could be cut off and there's also um, in situations where it can be referred to the Department of Justice. I can't control the past. I can't control what happened a year ago or two, two years ago. But my focus will be on the students and the staff. In Southlake. We will continue to focus forward and not be distracted. I'm Mary Placencia.